In today's video lecture, we will be discussing all the chapters which will come in your maths board exam for the year 2023 board exam, 2024 board exam, 2025 board exam and the following exams. So, this is a part 2 video of the most important questions of the chapters. In part 1 video, I had discussed important questions from chapter real number to chapter number 7 coordinate geometry. In today's video, I will be discussing all the important questions from trigonometry, similar triangles and all the remaining chapters till statistics. So let's begin. First of all, you have some important points which you need to remember for your board exam or for your FA and SA exams. In this, you have uh, what is a polygon. Okay, and then uh, the ratio of the corresponding sides is known as scale factor. Then all regular polygons having the same number of sides are similar. These questions will be important in MCQs. Okay, so just underline these points. Okay, then you have uh, these points also which are important. Then in the next page of similar triangles chapter, basic proportionality theorem, it can ask you statement and also it can ask you proof. So practice the proof well. The try this is important. This question is important. Okay. Practice that and also theorem to prove you practice. Then this question uh, in which you have to divide the line segment in the ratio 3 is to 2. This is important in 2 marks. So practice it well. Okay. How to divide a line in 2 parts. Then we have example 2 is important in 4 marks to find out x. Then do this. First question, second question is important. Then also example 3 is important. In exercise 8.1, question number 4 is important. In, and example 6 is important. Then uh, question number 4 is important. Question number 7 is important. In exercise 8.2, we have exercise uh, 12th question is also important in exercise 8.2. Then example 14 is important. Example 15 is important. And uh, in exercise 8.4, second question is important. And 8th and ninth question is also important on page number 207. 8th and ninth question. Then we have so in try, uh, try this of page number 211. Second question, third bit is important. Then example 5 is important. Then from chapter MCQs, actually you will have one question of one mark and one question of two marks if you see here. Then two questions of one mark, one question of four mark and one or two questions MCQs. So totally one plus one, two, two plus two, four, four plus four, eight, ten marks will be there from insulation chapter. So practice it well. In this, uh, in objective or in one mark, they can ask you all these formulas and where I have put star cuboid lateral surface area, prism lateral surface area, tube lateral surface area, cylinder, LSA, TSA volume. Then study all these on which we have stars, mark it and study it, learn it. Then a question on L square is equals to R square plus Z square can be asked, learn that formula well. Then example 5, second bit to find out CSA of right circular cylinder is important when radius and height are given. Then we have example 7 is important, then exercise 10.1, question 3 is important, 4 is important, 5 and 6 is also important. And in mensuration, what I have observed in the question papers is that they will twist the question and give. They will not give direct questions, but the questions will be similar to this. So practice and read the question well at least 3 times before you solve any question. The needs question is also important in exercise 10.1. Then... In exercise 10.2, we have first question, second question, third question, fourth question, fifth question, sixth question is important. Okay. And example 10 is also important. Then we have exercise 10.3, first question is important. Then exercise 10.3, only six question is also important. Then in exercise 10.4, an example 18 is important. Then in exercise 10.4, fourth question is important, sixth question is important, and also seventh question is important. Then uh, example one is important in trigonometry on page number 279. Then example two is important 
in exercise 11.1 second question is important seventh question is important then this table 11.1 is important in which you have to learn the values of sin 0 then cos tan cot secant cosecant till 90 0 to 90 degrees then example 7 is important in exercise 11.2 first question is important second question is important third fourth fifth sixth seventh all questions are important in this exercise 11.2 in trigonometry then example 10 is important here then in exercise 11.3 first question first bit is important second question first bit is important then also example 12 is important uh, second question is important third question is important and tenth question is important then in exercise 12.1 applications of trigonometry second question is important here then uh, eighth question is important and uh, example 6 is important exercise 12.2 first question is important then uh, in exercise 12.2 we have uh, third uh, fourth question is important fifth question is important see these questions are important just mark it okay then we have in probability example four is important and uh, question number five is important in the first exercise and question number seven is also important in the first exercise example eight is important or first bit in which in the question it gave p red marbles instead of four red marbles then example 11 is important and example 9 is important and exercise 13.2 first question third question fifth question sixth question and seventh question are important then 13th question is important very important and uh, 11th question is important then in statistics chapter it can ask in two marks to find out formula of direct method mean by direct method mean by assuming method mean by step deviation it can ask you formulas of mode and ask you explain the terms in it ask you formula on median and tell you to explain the terms in it and this point should be considered whenever you find uh, median the class interval should be continuous so in statistics basically you have four concepts practice all the four concepts practice mean by all the three methods direct method assuming method and step deviation method then practice mode practice median so this is the first concept mean by these three methods a b c direct assumed step deviation then mode then median and then ogive curves so remember or anything can be asked but surely one question will ask will come from these so practice all these questions well and definitely learn the formulas of mean median mode well okay so this was uh, all the important questions this completes are both the parts of the important questions of maths for all these students who are going to appear in a 2023 board exam then in 2024, 2025 and following exams and also it is important for pre-finals, practice papers. Okay, so study well. All these questions I have carefully uh, seen the pattern and seen the last year papers and then only have given you important questions. So all the very best to you all. May God help you all to become successful. Thank you very much. Like, share and subscribe. Like, share, subscribe. Click that bell icon.